Hey guys, it's your girl Urban Chick One, and today is day eight of my 30 day YouTube blast. I'm coming today to talk to you about the moisturizers I've used and the best ones that I think worked works for my hair. So it's basically a review on moisturizers. This was requested, so I'll try my best. So um the best one that I like using so far that um I just decided to pick up was the organic root stimulator carrot oil. Um the reason why I like this because it's more of a creamy consistency. Um other moisturizers I've tried were Wave Nouveau. And that's kind of a light consistency, but I don't like the residue that it leaves because it's glycerin. So I'm not really using Wave Nouveau that much. Um, there was S Curl, but that also has glycerin, so that leaves a residue on my hands. And I didn't like that. So, so um, I like this one a lot. Here's... I'm trying to get it. It's just really... Um, so you can get an idea of the consistency. So it's um, a creamy consistency. It's not so thick. Oh, I got a text. And then my herbal essences, none of your frizziness, um, which I'm using since I couldn't find the herbal essence in split and protector. My Elastic Q H2 QP, Elastic QP leave in conditioner, which I use as a spritz. I just use this um, leave-in conditioner and then just spritz it. This is a quick light spritz on my hair, you know, rub it all in just to give it a little moisturizing boost until I'm ready to really um, moisturize and seal. So I think this is good to use as like a spritz. You can call it that. <laughs> um, now, those are my light moisturizers. Now I'm getting into my heavy stuff. Um, I use these more when my hair is really, really, really dry and it's the winter time or if I um, air dried and my hair isn't so straight so it's okay for me to put a heavier moisturizer in my hair. So, um, olive oil mango butter moisturizer. This stuff smells really good. This is really good. Um, it's just a little bit thicker than all the other ones. This is more like a... It's just a little bit thicker, basically. It's more like a whipped cream compared to these being like a regular cream. So, um, if your hair is is not, you know, it's been perm, straight, and roller set, whatever you want to call it, um, I recommend just use a little bit. Don't use a lot. Like, just put. You don't need no more than like this for your whole head. Maybe even less than this. Just and then rub it all in and then just put it all in your hair and then after you're done concentrate on the ends and then even on the ends you might just need like a dab just this much rub it in and just put it on the ends yeah don't use a lot then your hair won't get weighed down um so yeah so this is my this is my first heavy moisturizer and this oh i love this stuff especially if um you don't want to spend too much money on moisturizers if you are heavy handed. This was only $3.49 at my local beauty supply store. This is Hollywood Beauty Olive Cream. Oh, stuff is so good. And it's this is thicker than the Elasta QP Mango Butter. This is thicker. So this is really good for laying down your hairline. And if you um, air dry your hair, and you can you really need to... Um, if you really need to get that moisture in so I love this stuff too um now I have something that's even a little bit this is more okay and now my third um moisturizer is this is shea butter leave-in conditioner by shea moisture see that um, it says for best results use after shea moisture shea butter shampoo or as a daily moisturizer to instantly replenish lost moisture and strengthen here apply from roots to ends and style so I love this stuff and the ingredients is shea butter water herbal complex panthenol um, glycerin cocoa butter aloe vera jojoba oil and vitamin E so 
I love their line. They have a lot of really good, you know, this natural ingredients. So I don't have to second guess, like, oh my god, I, I can't pronounce it. What the heck is this ingredient? So, yeah, and this is the consistency. So I use this um when I air dry my hair, and I also use it as a um, moisturizer sometime. But it's this is also really creamy. Let's see, so I only use a little bit of this. Don't use a lot if you, you know, get certain. That's the key. If your hair is relaxed, just don't use a lot, you know. I know it's hard sometimes. Like, you just want to, you know, get all up in there. But take your time and, you know, you'll get it straight. <laughs> so, that's my review on moisturizers. So, just switch it up and depending on how the consistency of your hair. But if it's ear dry, if it's really thick or if it's straight and it's light and you want to keep that bounce and not weigh it down then it that depends on which ones I use. So so again this is your girl Urban Chick One and I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye.